As Canada gets set to mark a milestone anniversary, we wanted to introduce you to some of our country's lesser known spots and stories. In Halifax, Alexander Keyes Brewery is an institution, as we know, and certainly a stop for visitors and locals alike. What you might not know, however, is that the building may just be haunted. Yeah, haunted. I recently had the chance to take a tour and hear about whose ghost may be hanging around. had some visitors. We did, yeah. We have lots of visitors, actually. Yes, but, but some that are standing out in particular, you had mediums come through here? We did. We had a couple of psychics. There's a psychic convention in Nova Scotia. Uh, a couple visited the brewery. They heard a lot of great things about how old the building was. We met them in the courtyard unexpectedly, and uh, they took us on a journey through what our brewery. Happened? We first arrived. Uh, as soon as we slid open this door, uh, they both in unison looked up at the top of these stairs and both reacted sort of dramatically that the Mr. Keith, somebody was up there. And there was not, nobody up there that I, I was seeing, right? Okay. So I said, well, who's up there? And they said, well, there's the, the gentleman who runs the brewery is up there. And I said, well, what does he look like? And he talked about his mutton chops and salt and pepper and, and period outfit from the you know, 1800s. And I finally said, I said, well, is it this guy here? And they said, oh, that is him, but he's, much, he's 20 years younger up here. Oh. And I said, and what's he doing? Well, he's kind of standing here, not threatening, but he's you know, authority, authoritative and letting us know that he's, he's, uh, he knows we're here and uh, he's in charge. We start heading up the stairs. Yeah. Our medium, Shadia, is, gets to about here. Mm -hmm. She suggests Mr. Keith has sort of moved back here. Okay. And she says, stop, she goes, oh, he doesn't like something up here. And I said, well, there, there's nothing up here but the, the timeline. And she looks over here and says, uh, you have things that are, there aren't real artifacts in the timeline. He doesn't like that, which we do. We've got um, the, uh, visuals of things, um, logos on cans, but the logos are old, but the cans would be aluminum, so the cans wouldn't be old. Let's explore that a bit. So I said, well, Shadi, I said, what's real and what's fake? And she starts looking past me over here, right? So she's really not looking down here. And she literally went down the line, real, real, fake, real, kept looking back for answers. She's not even looking down. She got to this point here, this is the, the right up on the death of Mr. Keith. She said, um, he really likes this, but he wants it blown up bigger. No Keeps way. looking back, real, 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 fake, real, real, went all the way down the line and got him 100% correct. You're kidding. No. So, guess what? Got my attention. <laughs> <I bet. laughs> yeah. What did you hear from the psychic? Yeah, so the psychic, as she was touring the, uh, the house, was moving up these stairs. Uh, she started getting short of breath, uh, pain in her chest, pain in her head, significant pain in her head. Uh, she was unaware that Mr. Keith had died of a stroke, but she was feeling he was stroking, and uh, she claims that he collapsed right here on these steps and died. Right here? Right here. Do you believe it? Believe what you want.